Okay, I told myself I wasn't even going to do another episode, but I just couldn't help it. He's getting so close to finding out who she is. And I'm over here like, you know what? It's fine. It's cool. It's whatever. I need to know, like, if he finds out. Like, I just want to know and <laughs> maybe I can stop. Who knows? But, yeah. We're... Uh, what's up, YouTube? This your girl, Deidre. <laughs> here with another episode video for you guys. And today we're on episode six. Let's find out what happens next. Because, I mean, he found out where she actually lives at. So, ugh. And he stumbled upon all those bodies. Oh, there she go. Once I got home, leaving Zion alone at the hotel, I turned off my security alarm and checked my camera. I was shocked at how many wolves I seen. I changed and then ran as fast as I could to where my cameras placed the rouges. Six of them in total. I cannot let Zion get to them first. Richard must know we are here. What are we going to do, Skye? I don't know, Ember, but we will figure it out. I won't let him hurt mate. No, we won't. I shifted into my wolf. Oh, damn. Then took off running faster than before. I had to get there and fast. Wow. Six of them, though. Looks like finding the white wolf was easier that, than we thought. Snickers. <laughs> finding me? I literally just walked up to you idiots. Come quietly and no one gets hurt. Once he said that, I immediately thought about Alika, Zion, and the others. That was enough to put me in such a rage that my body was in the position to fight before his words fully hit my ears. I know I barely know them, but that's my sister and my mate's family. I'll kill and die before they are affected because of me. How dare he threaten them? Don't believe us? Bring, bring out the girl. Girl, what girl? Wait, what girl? I snared as loud and deep as I could as one of the wolves walked behind the others, grabbing whatever girl they are talking about. If I was you, I would just give up. Well, you're not me. We will never give up. No, we won't, Em. What girl are they talking about? As the wolf returned, he tossed the black-haired female in front of me. What the? She was almost unrecognizable. Wait, is that Brim? It took me a few seconds to place her face, and when I did... Brim! Oh my god! It is Brim! Once it suck in that these six pieces of shit... I heard a hair on her head. I began to lose control. As Ember started to take control of my mind, my snares became deeper than before and I could feel my fur burning. As the wolf bent down and grabbed Brim by her hair, pulling her to her knees, I let out a slight whine which, which led them to smirk. As Brim's eyes locked on mine, she looked so sad, so defeated, like she knew she was going to die. You don't scare us, Skylar, Skyla, but that doesn't mean you're not scaring your little friend here. As the wolf said my name, Brim jumped. She was startled by hearing it was me that was the wolf. But then her face went, went back to being scared. Oh my goodness. But this time, it wasn't for herself. It was for me. Wait, do you do your friends not know who you really are, Skyla? Oh God, sneers. This is unbelievable. Screw this. I locked eyes with Brim. Who was looking like she wanted, she was about to faint. 
Oh gosh. Poor girl. I whined so loud trying to tell her everything I felt. Hoping she knew I wasn't going to let anything happen to her. It's okay, Skyla. I know you had your reasons. Don't worry about me. As Brim said those words, the wolf shoved her to the ground so hard she was out within seconds. I couldn't take it any longer. They are not leaving this territory alive. I guess not. They just did the most. How'd they even find her? And where's her mate? Where did he go? Oh my gosh, look at all this. I ripped through all of them as fast as I could. I was so worried about Brim. So angry about what they did to her that even when they were begging me for their lives, I showed no, I showed not even an ounce of mercy. They deserve to die. Oh man. This is crazy. And I guess she's just dragging her. Yeah? I shift back and drag Brim a safe distance away from what I've just done. I knew Zion would find her soon. I could already smell him getting closer. I am so sorry, Brim. I hope you can forgive me. Sky, Zion is coming. I hate this, but we have to go. I know. This is wild. So that's what happened. And that's when he showed up. Brim! Brim, babies, please wake up! We can't lose her, Cass. She's the only part of Mom we have left. Amish was shaking Brim, trying to wake her up. I, I just can't lose my sister. Ash, will you go talk to Jones and see what the damage is? Of course. Oh my gosh, how wild. Brim, please baby, you have to wake up. I can't do this without you. Skyla? Skyla? Yeah, right. No, no, it's me. They're going to kill her. We have to save her. Who's going to kill her? The Rouge is Zion. She's the white wolf. What do you mean? Oh my gosh. You supposed to keep it a secret? Ah! No. Brim, you shouldn't be standing. This is terrible. I'm fine, Zion. I'll heal. But we have to find Skyla. Brim, we need to get you to the hospital. No! They're going to kill her, M Amesh. I hope I say his name right, Amish. I won't let that happen, Brim. Amish, take her to the hospital and get and get her checked out. Asher and I will find Skyla and Alika. No, I'm going with you. She saved my life. I know she's hurt and all, but she's so hot when she's being sassy. <laughs> Come on, man. Brim, I will find them and bring them to the pack house. Please go get checked out, and I'll meet you there. Please, Zion. I know we don't let Rouges in our territory, but it's Skyla and Alika. Please, for me, don't hurt them. I promise I won't hurt the hair on their heads, okay? Okay. <sighs> it's like she can relax now. <laughs> now, please go. Let us know what the doctors say. How do you feel about this? Oh my god! What are we looking at? I counted six deceased ruses. Bloody hell. They're all dead, goodness. Oh! Oh my god. 
I know Skyla did this. That's what Brim says. I just can't imagine it. Should we tell Brim that Skyla is not in danger anymore? Since she killed them all? <sighs> not funny, Ash. What am I going to do, Ash? I don't know, but you promised Brim to protect them, so that's what we gotta do. Let's just burn these bodies, then we'll make up a plan. Damn, this is so much. What are you going to do? Alika! You alright, man? You just, like, fucked up six people. Like, God. What's up, Sky? Oh my gosh, Skyla, are you okay? No, everything went wrong. They took Brim, Lex. What do you mean, they took Brim? Oh my gosh, I mean that when I got there, they had Brim. It's not safe here anymore. We have to leave. We can't leave, Sky. Yes, we can, and we have to, Lex. Sky, please, I can't leave. You want to tell Asher, don't you? I I'm sorry, Sky. I tried to fight it. I really did. I know, Lex, but you know if you stay, I can't leave. Sky. I meant what I said, Lex. I will not let you get hurt. Sky. No, Alika. It's not safe if we stay here. But I will not make you leave, Asher. And I will not leave you. What are we going to do, Sky? I knew this was going to happen. Her eyes had so much pain, I couldn't handle it. While it was breaking my heart to look at Alika, I know what I, I know what I have to do, what has to be done. It sucks knowing that I'm about to walk out of the life of the only family I have. You will tell Asher the truth. Are you going to tell Zion? No. I will go go you make sure you are safe with them. Then we will be parting ways. No, Skyla. You can't leave me, Skyla. I need you. I will never leave you, Lex, but it's not safe for anyone if I'm if I'm out in the open. I will be watching you. You will never have to worry about me leaving you, Lex. Please, Skyla. You can't do this. I can't leave I can't leave you to be alone. Lex, I was always meant to be alone. You were never supposed to be here. I love you so much, Alika. And because I love you, I cannot let you stay here with me. You need to you need to go be with Asher. P please, Sky, don't do this. I will go with you to make sure you are safe. But after that, you won't see me for a while. N no, this isn't fair. This is sad and dramatic at the same time. Oh no, girl. I love you with all my heart, Lex, okay? This is like a really self-sacrificing thing. I love you too. So much. Text Asher and tell him you want to see him somewhere public. And trust me, I don't want this, but this is the only way. Please stop crying, Lex. I, I just don't want to leave you. I know, but it's time, okay? This sucks. Text Asher. I'll go pack your stuff. I love you, Alika. This is terrible. But I got a feeling um, homeboy ain't gonna let that happen.
This is so terrible. Lex? Alika? Hello? Ash, I... I... <sighs> I know about you and Skylar, Lex. We're not mad, but we do need to see you. I'm sorry, Ash. Just meet us, okay? We didn't want this, Ash. I believe you, Alika, but... But... <sighs> Just meet with us, okay? We can talk more in person. We won't hurt you. You have my word. This is so crazy. Lex, please don't cry. I'm sorry. Meet us at the beach in an hour, okay? Okay. Damn, click, he hung up. Oh man, <laughs> I don't know what's gonna happen. I mean, mm. It was honestly killing me watching Alika cry. We have been through so much together. This sucks, Sky. I know. I hate this, but we don't have a choice. Let's do this then. Putting on a brave face for this is one thing. Keeping it keeping it is going to be a different story. Yeah, I know. Oh man. But what what are they going to say to them? I'm I'm very curious now. Are you ready to go? Are you ready to go get your maid on? What did you say? I said, are you ready to go get your mate on? Stop trying to make me laugh, Sky. There are worse things than laughing. Are you ready? I'm scared. You have nothing to be scared of. I will be there the whole time. Do you need to change first? No, I'm okay in this. All right, let's go. Okay, Sky. What the hell is even going to happen? That's the part that's going to be bad. Either this is going to be bad or just shocking. I don't know anymore. Neither Alika nor I said a word the whole walk to where we were meeting the boys. I know it might seem dramatic to some. Trust me, I get how pathetic it sounds. But even though I'm not leaving her and going to some other town, I also won't be in her life, at least not how I've been. Richard will keep sending rouges here until he gets fed up and decides to come himself. I don't want that. Push all the evil shit, plus all the evil shit he did to me out of the way. And he still killed their parents and half of their pack. I don't want to leave them, but I really don't want him to come here. So what do I do? I really don't know. But I really need to figure it out. This is wild. Huh. <sighs> This is not good. Not at all. Well, this is it. Are you ready? Ugh, honestly, no, I'm not. It'll be fine, Lex. Trust me. I, I just feel like everything is about to change. Well, yeah, it is. You will be with your mate and you won't have to run anymore. This is exactly what I've always wanted for you. It just sucks you won't be able to join us. Maybe not right now, but one day I will be standing right next to you all. Promise? Promise. Oh boy. This turned real dramatic all of a sudden. I don't know how to feel. Get out your scent, I guess. Skyla. Zion. You wanted to talk? You know I learned something today. Oh yeah? 
What was that? It's the funniest thing. I had no idea you were a wolf. And and not just any wolf, a white wolf. Does it or does it not turn you on knowing that I could be under you in both human and wolf form? <laughs> Yo, I didn't expect that. <laughs> I didn't expect that. Is she crazy? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh oh my gosh that is so funny wow she is just like zion so freaking sexy <laughs> that is hilarious no i'm not this is serious skyla is it is it really zion Oh, gosh. <laughs> this isn't a bloody joke, Skyla. Do you know what we do to Rouges? Yes, I do. That's why we came here. What is that supposed to mean? Hell if I know. What is that supposed to mean? We know what happened to your parents. And we know your reputation. That's why we came here. So what did you think I was weak and would never find out? It's the opposite, actually. I know you're strong, Zion. In fact, that's the only reason we are here. Because I know how strong you are. And as for you fighting, and as and as for you figuring us out, we've been here for almost two years, Zion, and you had no clue. If those rouges wouldn't have grabbed Brim, you still wouldn't have known. I'm grateful for what you did for Brim, but that is not the point. Look, I'm sorry that you're mad about this, but this conversation is not why we came here. Then why did you come here? Go ahead, Lex. It's, I'm your mate, Asher. <laughs> I can't even whisper that. Ah, I just feel so just good for her. I'm, oh my God, oh my God. I'm nervous for her too. Oh God, oh God. I'm your mate, Asher. I speak up, Alika. Oh man. <laughs> I'm your mate, Asher. I know. You know? Yes, I know. I might not be able to smell you, but I know what I feel. Sky, will you drop my barrier? How would Skyla be able to hide someone else's scent? I've never heard of anyone being able to before. As I let Alika's scent go free, I watched as Asher's eyes lit up like Christmas morning. Done. As my eyes traveled to Zion's, he was lost he was lost deep in thought. Oh man. I just can't look away from those stunning blue eyes. Look at her. <laughs> it just works. Uh, why is he so damn good looking? Well, you can't help yourself, girl. Yay! I'm so happy for them. Oh my gosh. So, I'm going to just go. <laughs> Later. Skyla! Oh my god. And of course he runs after her. Yay, they're together. It works. Skyla, wait. <laughs> he just ran after her. Well, of course I guess he was going to run after her. Where are you going? Home. Are you just going to leave Alika with us without a goodbye? She will be okay. 
She has you guys, and I have to go. Wait. Oh my goodness. What, Zion? What could you possibly want from me? Seriously? You you hide you hide in my territory for what? For what did you say? Oh yeah, almost two years. You killed what? What's that? You killed what is the court up to new to now seven ro roses? The count. Sorry, the count is up to seven roses. I can't read. <laughs> and you really are going to ask what I want from you? I want a fucking explanation. I want to know why I feel a bond with us when when you're with me. I want to know how it is that you can shield not only your own scent, but Alika's. I want to know why my sister swears up and down that not only are you the last white wolf alive, but that you were at one point on fire. Wow, that's a lot of questions. I won't answer them all in detail, but to quickly answer you. Yes, I am the white wolf, and yes, I can catch fire. Before you ask, no, I have no idea why. As for shielding the sense, as for shielding the senses, it took me a long time to be able to shield others. And I can only do that if I'm a part of the same pack. We have to share that connection. As for the bond you feel between us, I'm pretty sure you already know why. But I'll help you out just in case. <laughs> and then there they go. Why even? <laughs> this game kills me. <laughs> <laughs> I grab Zion by the collar of his jacket, smashing my lips onto his. I felt him sigh in relief and his whole body relaxed. So I so I ever so slowly released my scent. In an instant I felt his whole body tighten. Oh man. His kiss his kiss became becoming more powerful than before, more erotic. Then, then that one word I never thought I would hear came forcefully out of his mouth. Mine. <laughs> Young. <laughs> he says, mine. <laughs> Cute. No, it is there. Ah! I can't with this. It is right there. Are you kidding me, bro? Ah. Uh. Yo, this game is killing me. Yeah, this, this game is killing me. <sighs> Apparently, that's the end of the episode, guys. Thanks for watching. Here's her Instagram on the top of the screen. Be sure to follow her. And that's it for this episode, guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. If you like this video, slap that like button. Oh, while you're at it, you might as well slap that subscribe button. So you see more me and like these damn cliffhangers. God. Till next time, people. Bye. Stay safe. Wash your hands and stay away from crowds if you're not trying to get sick. Bye.